hello everyone welcome back to TLT studio today we're going to look at functions and relations so we have two functions we have f of x equal 3x minus 4 and we also have g of x equal 2x minus 1 alright for us to find f of 5 all we would do is to substitute the value of 5 anywhere you see x in the function so, all right so remember it's it so remember it is the f function and you're going to substitute 5 anywhere you see x in the function all right so we have f of 5 equal 3 times 5 minus 4 which is 15 minus 4 which is 11 alright so let us do another alright so we have a second function which is f of 2 so to solve f of 2 all we have to do is substitute the value of 2 into the f function so we're going to have f of 2 equal 3 and then we're going to put the value of 2 substitute 2 anywhere we see x in the function minus 4 so this is 3 times 2 which is 6 minus 4 which is equal 2 so f of 2 is equal 2 we're going to do another one alright so we have the function f of negative 10 so we have f of negative 10 equal 3 multiply by negative 10 minus 4 so all you're doing is substituting the value anywhere you see x in the equation alright so this is going to give us negative 30 minus 4 which is equal to negative 34 so f of negative 10 is equal negative 34 alright so we're going to take a look at the g function which is g of x equal 2x minus 4 and right here they're asking us to find g of 2 so all you're doing is very simple all you're doing is substituting the value of 2 anywhere you see x in the function so we're going to have g of 2 equal 2 multiply by 2 minus 1 so this is going to equal to 4 minus 1 equal 3 so g of 2 equal 3 so let us try another one alright so we have the function g of 4 so we're going to have g of 4 equal 2 multiply by 4 minus 1 so the value of 4 we will substitute that anywhere we see x in the function so this is going to give us 8 minus 1 which is equal to 7 so g of 4 the g of 4 function is equal to 7 alright so we're going to take a look at composite functions and I'm going to show you how you would work a composite function alright so I'm going to show you how to work a composite function so we now have the function f of g of x and what this means is that you're going to put all of the function of g anywhere you see x in the f function so let us rewrite this so you can understand it better so remember we're putting all of the g of x function into 
into the f function so we're going to rewrite this so in because g of x is equal to this we can rewrite it as f of 2x minus 1 so this 2x minus 1 is what you're going to put anywhere you see x in the f function so we now have this equal to 3 and anywhere you see x you're going to put everything in bracket minus 1 minus 4 and this is equal to 6x minus 3 minus 4 which is equal to 6x minus 7 so f of g of x is equal to 6x minus 7.